Many of you all must be up to date with the controversy that has happened with of the AIFF General Secretary. Now I just want to just speak about it. First, I'll announce what was uh, written by IFTWC. The AIFF have announced that they have terminated General Secretary Shaji Prabhakaran from his role with immediate effect due to the breach of trust in him. The IFF Deputy Secretary Mr. M. Satyanayan will take charge as Acting Secretary General of AIFF immediately. Now this is a huge thing okay? because uh, it recently came out that of course breach of trust is a huge issue when it comes to big co corporations, companies, organizations etc. Whenever you sign a contract with anyone which a uh, huge company is always about uh, not allowing out, uh, information of the company go out. okay? So if you all didn't know about this, uh, General Secretary Saji did tell that why AI, uh, so someone had asked why why light was not present and he directly said that why light isn't present in ISL because AIFF doesn't have the funds to do it. Now first of all, what he did is wrong, okay? In normal terms, if you look in business point of view, in a contract it states that you can't tell uh, the inside information of a com organization to the outside world it is wrong and so basically his resignation is uh, you know is a correct decision by AIFF but the second thing that I think we all should be considering or should be focusing on is that how the hell AIFF doesn't have funds okay VAR light is a cheaper version of VAR and it doesn't have those many cameras doesn't have those many motion sensors those doesn't have uh, that much technology that or investment cost that normal uh, that normal VAR needs okay so I am kind of confused how in the hell did we come to a situation where AIFF doesn't have money okay now I know FSD, uh, FSDL takes a huge sum of ISL money from the revenue but we also have to remember AIFF gets some, some revenue from I-League from um, of course after I league they get from the Indian matches whatever they sell so and whatever broadcasting rights that they get for Indian matches so I am kind of confused how AIFF don't have money now maybe they are spending some money on infrastructure grassroots development that is their main focus so they don't have that much funds for VAR light which could be understandable if there was more clarity about the expenditure now Shaji did of course talk about it but the issue is there's very less context here i mean there's very less more details here because we know aiff is not spending but where are they spending the money that they do have that's my question uh apart for the thing reason why he was knocked off why he was uh, told to resign well of course you cannot go against uh, the contracts that you signed so i can understand uh, why aiff have tried i mean have sacked him but Otherwise, uh, this is kind of an interesting topic that needs to be searched in further more details about AIFS spending. What are your thoughts? Tell me in the comments.